They did you you ever hear people say that he was like Tupac? God know the love I had for Soldier Slim. That's it. We know we we love Soldier Slim. He was our Tupac. Yeah. A lot of people, like Snoop Dogg mm -hmm. said that. I, I mean, when you first put me on, I mean, when you walked yeah. in the studio, it was like, yeah. bruh, this man is the closest yeah. thing to Tupac. Yeah, and I'm yeah. yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. You know, I put that one out this morning about y'all, uh, about BG. Um, basically, just uh, the fact of how they knew each other and just kind of how you guys, you know, how you responded to BG. Yeah. Hey, what's that? They won't renail on yeah. the phone, yeah? Man, tell him be cool, man. You know, somebody want to ride down on the phone. Um, there was a lot to go with your dad. They, did you you ever hear people say that he was like Tupac? God know the love I had for Soldier Slim. That's it. We know we we love Soldier Slim. He was our Tupac. Yeah. A lot of people, like Snoop Dogg mm -hmm. said that. I, I mean, when you first put me on, I mean, when you walked yeah. in the studio, it was like, yeah. bruh, this man is the closest yeah. thing to Tupac. Yeah, and I'm yeah. Man, I spoke on this. I spoke on this. Really? In the interview, I think it was Beehive. Okay, what happened? If I'm not mistaken. No, was it Beehive or was it Big D? I don't know, but they was in my they was in my DM going crazy. What did you say? Yo, daddy could never be with two. They got mad wow. about it. Yeah, they got mad about it. What did you I, say? Um, I basically just said like you know, like, all right. I wasn't disrespecting Tupac, you know what I'm saying? Tupac always going to be... Yeah, he's he, uh, he he always really be that a me. huge dude. But I was just saying, like, you know, like, after Tupac died, they had people coming up with other stories about him, you know, like, that he wasn't really like what he portrayed, you know? Yeah, they did. Mm -hmm. So I said, that'll never be Soldier Slim. Oh, you know yeah, I mean? yeah, yeah, it, yeah. It ain't, them, it ain't them stories, you know what I'm saying? It ain't yeah. nothing like that. Because yeah. whatever they portray um, social seem to be, that's what he is. That's what he is. Correct, but you got to understand, Pac right. was an was, uh, actor, too, and went right. to school and exactly. all that. So. so that's all I was saying. Like, you know, my dad was really from the streets. streets. He had zero opportunity. 14-year-old on coke and dope, you feel me? Like, yeah. yeah, that's the difference. You know what I'm saying? So I wasn't disrespecting him. But they took it as that. But it was my damn cutting it up. It was cutting up. But but then they got the, the, the similarities. They have some similarities. Like, basically, you got to think about it. Your dad was shot as well before he went to prison. Yeah, my, my dad, the first time I got shot, he was 15 or 16. Do you do, Have you heard or family talk about why he got shot then? Yeah, him. see, him and my mom was together around that time. Okay. And he was like... 15, 16, or 17. In, in between them times, you know what I'm saying? My mom, I think my mom met him when he was like 16, so it had to be after 16. Um, yeah, I, like, I don't know. My pops my pops was different. But did he get, like what I'm saying, did he get, uh, when he got shot, then you was, even, you was you young, you was a baby baby. I wasn't born. You wasn't born? I wasn't born. But your mom, she was around. Yeah, um, he actually went stay with my mama, mama. Okay. You know, when he, yeah. When it happened. Yeah, she had I was like my like she be telling me stories about she had bought him all this Barbie equipment he need because you know he's a cut hair. I used to yeah, yeah. Cut hair. So she bought him everything he needed. You know what I'm saying? So he could cut hair. Yeah. Yeah. That's hard. That's hard because at the end of the day, you got to understand that you know, to, for him to come back hard like he did, even after being shot. So after he got shot, like a week later, he was on crutches, and. Somebody else tried to shoot at him. Uh, they started shooting at him, and then he was running across the the, the oh. clay barn. He had he had a K. He ran across the clay barn, the K and the crutches, and he got hit by a car. I think they said. Yeah. Damn, mm. he gets hit by a car. That's crazy because these are stories where, man, he could have been out of here a man. few times. You like to not been born. Yeah, you know what I'm he, saying. He ain't get run over, but he just he, he got just hit. Got, you know what I'm saying? Got bumped. Yeah. yeah. And that's crazy, but that's the way it be. Like, but God had a mission for you to be here, so sure. he had to get across that street. Yeah, we on Boss Talk One on One.